I'm so excited. You all look lovely tonight, but I got my eye on her. What's your name? Hey! Hey! Penny drops! <laughs> Girl with the juicy ass passes, you two. And your man looks. Would you mind? I'm also looking. What do you mean? Oh, oh that's <laughs> what's up! Hey, I'm the house like, oh. Hey, yo! Nah, nope. No trolling. We ain't trolling, y'all. Don't sweat it. Hey, what's up, gang? It's your boy, Sean 81 Jax, and welcome back to the No Trolling Podcast. And today, we got our beautiful, beautiful, amazing, ambitious black queen in the building. But she doesn't like to be called anything. She doesn't like any titles, so she likes to be referred as a student. Period. Yeah, Suraya, <laughs> what's up? How you doing? I'm good. Hi. Welcome to the podcast. Thank you. Ooh. Yeah, me is smiling. I'm so excited, but Ooh. be careful with those cars. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry, I got you. I got you. So we got this saying in the No Trolling podcast where we say, no trolling, don't sweat it. Yeah, so no trolling. Don't sweat it. Is it whenever I ask you a question, I say, don't, no trolling, you, you're like, don't sweat it, then you like, go on with your okay, answer. no problem. Uh, so, um, oh yeah, so Soraya here, you know. I, I saw her on Instagram and I was like, people always be asking me how I get my guests. Literally, it's really so random. Literally, so random. I just pick them, you know what I mean? And she, she wasn't on my radar right there, so I had to bring her through. So in today's uh, episode, like I always like to say, we are not professionals. We are not professionals, right? Are you professional? <laughs> She's not a professional. I'm not a professional. So we're, not all, a professional. we're not professional, so anything we say here, just take it, you know, just like that. You know, don't take it too, too much to heart. If you want to, you can, though. Uh, yeah, we're going to dive in right to the no trolling questions. Now, before that, tell us a little bit about yourself, though. Cause, okay. Yeah, yeah, well, tell us a little bit. My name is Soraya. Yeah, uh huh. Um, I'll keep my age private. Okay, okay. <laughs> um, I'm a student. I'm studying political science with international relations, and I'm in my third year. So yeah. That's it? Um, what else do you want to know? I, I mean, know. we can get into it when we get into the questions, no? Are you in a relationship? Uh, I'm just playing. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just playing with you. Uh, actually, OK, let's just dive into the first control question. All right, um, would you live with your boyfriend? No trolling. Don't sweat it. Yeah. Yes, I would. Yeah? Yeah. Damn. Okay. Clue me in. Like, what was the reason behind that? Um, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I would live with my boyfriend because I don't have a boyfriend currently. Yeah. I have in the past, yeah. but I don't think I would do it again. What's, what's, what happened? What, was it like... Uh, too much pressure, he was too much around? No reason, like we had a great relationship. I just feel like when you, you have to plan to get into that setting. Yeah. So if you don't plan, I feel like it's gonna be tough. It's gonna be a bit tough because both of you are not in the position to be with each other in the same household. I yeah. feel like that's like marital. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. a more marital situation. Yeah, so. for sure. I, I don't think I'd, I'd want to live with my girl. I mean, I, she could stay in for like a week or so, but not... Living for, like, yeah, no. No, no, like permanently staying there? Nah, that's crazy. I wouldn't do that. That's true. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you know how women expect guys to be husbands at a, at, a, at a boyfriend stage? And women usually don't do that. They don't give it back the same energy. They usually don't expect to be wives. Uh, at a girlfriend stage, they usually what, don't. What do you mean? Lay out the husband duties you're talking about. Okay, I take care of you. I pay for your bills. I take you out. You know, I protect you type shit. You know, that's husband. In duty. return. And girl, wife, and girls just just want to look pretty, and some most of the time it's. That's why I'm asking you. In yeah. return, like, what are the tasks that a woman is meant to do? Let's say. If the uh, wife if, duty? If the boyfriend is providing as a okay, okay, as husband, but well, maybe cook for him, maybe wash his clothes, maybe you see it's stuff like that. We're in modern day washing clothes. Ooh. So you wouldn't right. wash? 
You mean I, like, clothes? I would wash his clothes, but like, let's be for real. Like, we have, I'm a student. He, I would expect my man to have a job or if he's studying. Or if he's studying, like, you know, I wouldn't expect this guy to, no. We, washing clothes, we both, <laughs> no. <laughs> Absolutely not. You wouldn't wash your man's clothes? No. It's not a bad thing to I, do, though. I do, I'm not saying I wouldn't do it, yeah. but that shouldn't be expected of me because, come on, like, I can, I can cook for my man, I get it. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. washing clothes is a bit crazy. A little bit crazy? I mean, honestly... Um, on a daily, expect, especially if it's expected of you, that's, come on, that's a task yeah, that for, can be handled by someone else, but, I feel. But for me, like, honestly, I would not expect my girl to do all that stuff for me. Although if she does it, it kind of gives me that idea, like, damn, she, she, she's taking care of me like that. You know? Yeah, I feel like my love language these days has <laughs> been <laughs> cooking. These days? These days. My new love language is cooking. So I feel cooking, that's definitely, if for some women, they love it. And they love cooking for the people for that they love. love so yeah. it makes sense. But washing clothes, my guy. Damn. You're pushing it. Yo, you're, you're pushing, pushing it. <laughs> I ain't your mama. <laughs> I ain't going to do your laundry. I ain't your mama. Literally. Yo, that song where it, where it got out. All the, all the girls you know, hopped on it. Like. Yo, it's the self-esteem after that. Like, damn, don't play with me. I ain't yeah, your she, mama. Who sang that song, by the way? Beyonce. Beyonce. Yeah. Is it Beyonce? You're going to... <laughs> Wait, hold on. They're gonna no, drag no, no, no. it. Okay, okay, hold on. No, 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 hold on. Okay, let me, let me, let me. No, no, let, okay, hold on. I, 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 I ain't your mama. Is I know it's Beyonce. It's not Beyonce. Jennifer right? Lopez. Oh, Jennifer Lopez. Yes. Yes, oh my no, God. No, you're actually embarrassing. No, 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 no. no, no. Beyonce, he's going to jail. No, 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 my bad, my bad, my bad. <laughs> no. I actually thought... You need to get your shit together. Sometimes I mean... You need I, to get your listen, shit together. Listen, listen, listen. <laughs> Sometimes I do confuse... Beyonce the, and Jennifer Lopez? No, 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 listen, 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 listen. Growing up, they, they almost look a little bit like a like. You know what? Let's just let's let's hop into it. This argument can't right. go very far. <laughs> <laughs> let's just all right, all right, let's jump to the next question. Let's do. Uh, what's the first thing you notice when you see a man? No trolling. Don't sweat it. Yeah. First glance. First glance. Like, what do you like? The the first glance. I must be able to gather that this is a clean man. Like hygiene for me is very important. So I will definitely look at his nails. I'll definitely, like, other things, I might sound a bit crazy, but I might, yeah. I might, I'll look at his nails, I'll look at his hair, I'll look, just personal hygiene for me is very important. Yeah, so, yeah, that's the f number one for me. That's, that's fair, though. That's fair. Yourself? Me? Uh, I'd, 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 I think I'll look at, um, first, whenever I, like a, somebody walks in the room, anybody in general, I'll look at the face first. Do I know this person? So that's the first thing I notice. No, but like the first thing you know, okay, fine. You know this person or you don't. Let's say you don't know the person. Okay. So what's what's one thing like you're looking out for? Uh like she fine like she fine, like her face. Like, oh she fine. She fine. Like what? Okay, okay. Okay, after after that after okay, after that I will notice uh, maybe her body, I'll notice how what she's wearing. Then when she comes closer, that that's how I'll look at her nails. But nail girls usually have them, what's uh, what they call them tips, yeah, yeah. They have them tips so you can't tell if, you know, if it's if what if her nails are clean or not. Just by a girl taking care of their hands, I feel like is enough, don't you think? Okay. So even if they have ugly nails, if someone takes the time to go to the nail salon and yeah. get their nails done, I think you should appreciate that, no? Yeah, for sure. I do appreciate that. I do appreciate that. What I'm saying, but you can't actually tell what her nails look like. Okay, fine. Yeah. And what else do I notice? I think that's about it. So you look at face? Yeah. That's then the body. Then body. What she's wearing, I mean. Okay. Yeah, body and what she's wearing. It's that, that goes in the same book, you know what I mean? Yeah. All right. Should there be only one influencer in a relationship? No trolling. Don't sweat it. Yeah. What do you think about that? To be honest. Yeah. 
sure. I've never, I've never been in that type of situation. Oh, or I've never actually looked at it the way you just asked. But yeah. now that I think about it, I think it works both ways, to be honest. Because why? What's the problem? I mean, I'm just asking. What, what you know? like, what? Because I, I saw this debate going on, and I was like, oh, it's an interesting question. Let me ask this to my future guest. You know what I mean? Like, on my point of view, I feel like it, it shouldn't really matter who's a. I mean, I could date an influencer. And I could date a girl who's uh, being as an influencer has a lot of following and stuff like that. He, yeah, she has her own thing going on. I could do that. But I, but I feel like a lot of guys fear that, though, because they feel that maybe the girl has been around or uh, they fear a lot of guys, like, go after her. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. It becomes yeah. I mean, a a for sure, that's, a, that's something you, you should... That's a challenge, but you can't be backing away from challenges as a man. As a man, you should just persevere with it. You, know, you learn how to deal with it. You figure out a way around it. You know what I mean? Yeah, talk to the men. Tell them you need to deal with it. You need to figure out a way to persevere <laughs> around it. Exactly, <laughs> man. You shouldn't be like being like uh, chicken around, man. You're if chicken. You... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just quoting my guy, though. <laughs> It's, it's not me saying these things. He said it. <laughs> yeah, for sure, man. I feel like that shouldn't be... That as year. a man, I feel like you shouldn't... When, it, when, when a problem hits you, you shouldn't start complaining about it. You should find a way how to deal with it. That's, that, that's literally the best way to solve a problem. You don't complain. You find a way to deal, deal with, it. with it. Yeah. Um, so I, I feel like having a... This uh, don't, not dating a social media girl... Or this thing that where girls be saying that I want my man to have no Instagram, no na na nah, zero to following. Be, to be honest, let me tell you something. That's it's. What, what you trying it, to it's, say? It's calming. Like, do you know how calm it is to have a man that has hard that's not active on Instagram? Because imagine like you're going through Instagram, your man and five hundred others. Like you're thinking, yo, why are you liking this girl's picture type thing? Do you get what I'm saying? So you much rather not have. Okay, that okay. Like, and then some, if, someone will bring up the debate, uh, like, you're being insecure or so, but why, why am I scrolling through Instagram and then it's my man and 600 others? Like, please, come on, man. <laughs> like, <laughs> I mean, if you feel like that's an issue, you address it to him. No, definitely. Right? Yeah, you, you see, my point is actually, you just have to address the issue and you guys might come up with some, a solution. It. No, but if that if the if the nigga feels he can even do the liking, <laughs> oh, so, like, you, so you don't want your man to be liking other people's Instagram. Um, it depends. Like if it's his friend, <laughs> it's fine. But don't go on random girls' pictures liking them. You get like it's kind of weird. Okay, that, that's fair. That's fair though. That's like fair. you don't want your man and everyone every other girl's likes. Like, come on. But do you know how much? Impacts you can, but you can do just by having social media. You no, know, but, but, but what if he's doing it for business? Like, what if it's his job? Okay, then it's a given. Like, okay. like what? Like, well, as a photographer? Maybe a photographer, or maybe a content creator, a YouTuber, that's why podcaster. Would, that's why I would never be with any of those niggas. <laughs> Oh, just, damn. Just avoid the problem by personally. Okay, so what type of guys do you go for? Nerds. Nerds? Do you think nerds don't have Instagram? No, nerds, they, they have their focus on different things. Like, I, like gamers, let's say. I game. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a gamer. No, but you're not full-blown. Like, you got what I'm saying? You're not, you're not full-blown. You're a podcaster. Right? <laughs> Gamers post their content on YouTube, TikTok, do they have Instagram? Okay, maybe I'm I'm giving the wrong description. But like I need I need <laughs> okay. I would prefer Okay. I would prefer guys who don't have Instagram. I'd prefer a guy who doesn't have No, like I don't mind if the guy has Instagram, but I don't I just just you know Okay. You wanna low key yeah. like no, even if he is not low key, but like respect yourself. Of the, course, like, of course. But men don't respect themselves. Like what? <laughs> like men violate. Like they oh, on violate. Instagram? They do it everywhere. What do you mean? Just on the regular, they violate. Okay. So, <laughs> Damn. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, girls, do, girls go through a lot. Do you think we don't go through a lot? 
Like, imagine your girl posting, like, bikini pictures on Instagram. Some guys are very okay with that. In oh, fact, some like, guys, yeah, I know, but... In fact, most guys should be okay with that. I don't mind my man posting pictures of himself, and I don't mind girls liking his photos. Like, that's... That's... What, what can I do? I don't mind my man getting DMs from girls. Like, he... What can he do? He's a, he's a delicious-looking man. My problem uh-huh, is uh-huh. when there's an interaction, like... Why are you responding or uh, <laughs> why are you responding or why are you like, you know? No, nah, like it's the interaction for me. You can, I'm on Instagram, there's bare man in my DM, but it's the interaction. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> you said what? You said there's no people in your DM, like man? there's bare man. Like, bare man? Like a lot of men. Oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I, I heard something else. <laughs> but like seriously though, that's my point exactly. You can't. If your man has like Instagram or he's a very fresh person, it's not like he detains all those DMs. You know what I mean? We 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 do like be calm with it. It's not like we violate. Like for me, it's like my job to like DM people. Like it's part of my job. Unless I get a team to it do it for me. It all comes with intentions. Like you like it all comes with intentions. Like we know we can de- we could be we can de- de- debate this all day. We can debate this literally. all day. Literally, we can debate about this all day long because it all comes back to what the guy intended to do really when they're responding yeah. or when they're liking Actually, or when they're upper, doing Actually, we're dealing with respect and communication. Yes. For sure. At the end of the day, just communicate what you feel like to your partner and just, just be honest, man. Just be, and respect your partner, man. This social media right now is, is it's insane. It's toxic. Like, I feel like, I feel like we're, we're, so, we're so into this social media bubble where we're following people and we think that that's their life yeah. for real. more time my man is struggling like behind the scenes you know instagram yeah, is yeah, yeah. completely fake and i feel like a lot of people don't, don't that? believe that yeah i and mean they don't know i that. mean they, i think they should start believing because it is fake i'm only posting what i want you to see see exactly exactly like, nothing else like unless you're like and even if you're a vlogger it's still, <laughs> it's still, it's still like you choose what to show. Yeah, exactly. Like someone can be vlogging like you've only seen like one side of their room, room, like <laughs> type thing. You got what I'm saying? The other <laughs> side is all crap. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, <laughs> which is insane. I've these ever, things happen. I've ever done vlogging. I've tried. I've done one vlog before, mm-hmm. and I realized that it's it's actually <laughs> difficult. It's the putting the camera, walking away, and coming back to <laughs> <laughs> pretending like <laughs> like pretending like we're on dog. <laughs> then no, already, then cutting that. That's the reality of it, though. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it's true. It's and it's for people to watch, but it just can't be my life. It's yeah, too. yeah, no, no. I mean, vlogging is not really your life. You know, vlogging is just you trying to entertain people. It's like a movie. You're making a little movie of yourself. I'm trying to say that that type of social Ooh, so media, media is not uh, my uh, life. Ah, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. yeah. I wouldn't, I, I wouldn't be able to... Yeah, I do that a lot. I vlogging? Dive. Yeah, yeah, I do vlogging. And I'm going to start doing more vlogging videos this year, actually. For my so YouTube. you tell us, like, about uh. vlogging. Since you do it, you tell us, like, more about it. Can someone choose to show what they... You can, want? you can. You could because dev- someone, someone is taking us through their whole day, but... No, no, no. It, could, it could even be shot in... Several days, if that yeah, makes sense. Yeah, 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 it can actually. No, no, when I, when I, the vlogging that I'm talking about, it's like I'm doing an activity. I show the, the, the small parts of, during the activity. I'm not going to show the, literally everything. The whole day. That's a, it's going to be hours of, of footage and nobody's going to watch that. So you, you just, uh, you take a long footage and you make it short, like 18 minutes. And in, in that 18 minutes, you like put all the special parts you want to show. So you, you, you won't be showing the like disgusting part of the, or if that's the angle you were trying to go with, you can. But vlogging is literally, you can show whatever you want. You choose what you want to show. Exactly, that's vlogging. You, it's not really reality. Even if somebody sends you snaps and everything, streaking, do you streak? Do I what? Streak, like on Snapchat. Um, I want to say no, but I do have a 40 day streak with one of my best friends, so ah, okay, look, look. he'll get touched if I say no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we're going, we were down deep with that one. All right, um, the next question. If you two were sitting maybe at a park and a girl with a juicy nyash passes you two, 
any man looks, would you mind? I'm also looking. What do you mean? Oh, that's a <laughs> song! Hey, I'm that's a song! <laughs> hey, yo! That's fire! <laughs> that happens all the time. What do you mean? Oh, like, yeah, like, that's a song. What do you it's mean? It's not an issue. She has a fat ass. It's the facts. Like, she has a fat ass. She's walking and she has a fat ass. Like, uh, we're all admiring it. Ooh. Uh, yeah. Come on, it's just sometimes, sometimes it's the insecurities projecting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you'd be like, baby, baby, baby. Like, oh, damn, that's fire. <laughs> then you just, uh, you make a little bit of jokes about it, then you, you yeah, forget about done, it. Yeah, it's done, like. They'll be like, damn, look at it. Like, if, I don't even get it. Like, why would a girl be touched about a guy looking, we're sitting next to each other. This is a person I'm calling my man. He can't, he can't even, his eyes, like, as much as Anapazia. Kamisa, much as Anapazia. Much as Anapazia, Tafaya Nini, like, something nice. He can look. Yeah. But it's, it's when the guy takes the piss and starts staring, like, come on. You saw uh, the boy. Like, uh, yeah, you, you don't want the girl to also feel like you're looking at her for what? Like, yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, you don't do, don't do too much, though. Yeah, right? you don't do too, don't do too much. Don't, do, just a little bit, like, just a little ooh, bit. Ooh. Uh, okay, okay, yeah, okay. That's okay. That's back, that's back to the conversation. Yeah, <laughs> that's fine though. I feel like yeah, that, that minding that is kind of like kind of like extreme. What do you mean? You, how do you feel about? That? No, no, I'm good with it. if my, uh, if. Okay, but you see, like it's not like girls are looking at guys mataco. You get what I'm saying? No, like, it's do, not do like, girls uh, do that? No, that. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> Actually, I might not be, but <laughs> but yeah, like it's not like we're looking at that type thing. So, what is it like in a guy's point of view? Uh, when, I don't. Maybe when you're shirtless, looking at the chest and everything. Maybe that. You'd have a problem with that? No. I I don't mind, cause I don't know what you see when I'm not with you. <laughs> <laughs> Can you, the world is is vast, man. You might see a lot of stuff. Literally. So, if I'm being like insecure when I'm with you right now, I won't be. I won't survive when I'm up. Exactly. All right. Um. All right. We're going to dive into another one. By the way, guys, you're listening to the No Children Podcast featuring Soraya. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're on YouTube, and if you're on Spotify or audio, uh, any audio podcasting platform. Make sure you hit uh, hit us with a follow and leave us a nice review. You know what I mean? All right. Um, do you think these days people are valuing the wrong things while looking for a partner? No trolling. Don't sweat it. Mm. Um. Yes. Definitely, yes. Facts. It comes back to the whole social media thing, I feel. Tunapotosha. Sisi wanawake mostly. Like, tunangaya Instagram, tunafikiri, ah, kwa nini dada napata hiki? Ah, kwa nini kaka napata, I mean, who you dada napata hiki? You confused me. Nah, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Um, literally, I feel like people are valuing those, I don't know, I don't know what to call them, but you know those um, criterias, like, he has to be like, he has to. He has oh. to be like six five. He has to be. He has to have a job. He has to have a car. He has to be rich. He has to have his own place for me to date him. Like, is that really something you you, you want to like base on looking for a partner? To be honest, like, it can for some girls. Yeah, I, I'm not saying it's wrong to do that. If that's your you, that's your goal, go for it. There's no harm in it. But do you think that's like the, f- the first things you should look at? Not the first things you should look at, but these are qualities that some females prefer. Yeah. So if, let's say, for example, yeah. um, I have a job yeah. and my man doesn't. Mm-hmm. And it just so happens that every time we go out or every time we do things, yeah. I'm paying for it. Okay. As much as I don't mind paying for it, it kind of demeans his masculinity in some sort of way. And females, like, they don't know how to control themselves or their mouth. So I feel like in a situation like that, it's very easy for a woman to disrespect a man. So as a man, they should be able to, to, provide. to provide or handle their own thing just to, you know, maintain yeah. that respect, I feel. I mean... 
I like to look at, at it at this way. You know, first of all, you're definitely right. Whenever you, as a man, if you're like lacking those type of qualities, for some reason, the girl will not like, will a little bit undermine you a little bit. I mean, not sometimes it goes like way down there, but sometimes just you know level mid. But that's why I always tell my boys like, don't hop in a relationship if you know you cannot take care, care of that of the girl. girl like. You know. You don't, but sometimes people are like, ah, oh, it's just love, bro. We, we we just love each other, man. But at the end of the day... But at the... Kuna wazakano wengine wanakubaliana, you get? Yeah, like, I'm not saying that... Wanakubaliana kwamba, like, yeah, like, we can... We we can start together, like... Yeah, yeah, build a, a future together with both of us. Yeah, but that trial and error thing... Jafanya mm, <laughs> marangabi, like... Building you get what a I'm life, saying? Building a life with somebody. Yeah, you, how many times do you try build something with someone? So I think... It's safer, especially if you don't have someone to have that kind of makubaliano with. Yeah. It's safer for you to just build your own stuff. Like, these things fall into place, I feel. So. Yeah. I remember we said about the wrong things being those, the ones we said earlier about the cars. And, and, and. I feel like the right things could be if this guy is actually a, a good person, you know what I mean? Is he, uh, maybe some girls like a God fearing man. Uh, some girls, uh, I mean, is he like, um, does he take care of, does he actually, does he take care of his parents, you know what I mean? You know, you can have the guy who has all that, but he has a shitty personality, you know what I mean? No, but how, how are you, I don't expect a woman to, to be in a relationship with a man. It does happen, of course, mm -hmm. but if you're being realistic and you genuinely want to have a relationship mm -hmm. with someone, I don't expect a woman to fall into that because of assets or because of these other yeah, things. Yeah, it does happen. And then they, oh my God, it does happen. I know it does. So many I, times. I know it happens, but it just it's just so flabbergasting because how? Like, this is a person that you expect to stay with. This is a person that you're loving on. This is a person that you're sharing. Like, do you get what I'm saying? Yeah, so do, how, could, how could, how is it possible that, you know, you're, you're, falling, you're, you're falling in love with assets, but this person's a horrible person. It's, it's, people want to keep up with the socials. No. Post in Dubai. No. Post in fucking du I don't know where. Where, where, where else do we go? At the cost of what? My <sighs> my heart? No way. So <laughs> exactly violating the wrong things. I feel like you should man. But who, it's, it all comes back to morals. I feel. It's, yeah, like, but you have at, to at have some day, sort of. At the end of the day, man. I feel like we. I'm not telling you what to do with you with your life. If you if you have. Uh, like a like a set of like a way that works for you go for it go man. for it man we're not here to change you we're just talking you know, <laughs> we're man. just talking we're just talking <laughs> having a little chatty chat uh, the other day this guy came to me like yo can i borrow your um can i borrow your sunnies i was like what what are, the, what are, what are what sunnies? sunnies he made my glasses <laughs> You didn't know sunnies are shape? Nah. Like, the way he addressed it, though. Sunnies? Like, <laughs> <laughs> was it, okay, not to be that person, yeah. but what was his race? Race? He's Tanzanian. Light skin, though. <laughs> He's a light skin Tanzanian. I mean, um, you don't expect <laughs> <those things. laughs> Expect anything from the light skin. Oh, shit. <laughs> Do you like light skins or dark skins? I love my man chocolate. Hey! I love my man chocolate. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. I right, um, is being inconsistent mean your partner is cheating, not trolling? Don't sweat it. Yeah. No, there's other factors that can contribute to them being inconsistent. It doesn't necessarily mean they're cheating. It could mean they've, they've fallen out of love or they're going through their own thing or, you know, they just... It could be anything. It doesn't. It doesn't necessarily mean it's inconsistent. But inconsistency sometimes does happen when someone's cheating. So. Yeah. yeah. But you know. But you know, Tanzanian men that they can do it all. <laughs> they can do it all. Like <laughs> they, won't, they, won't, like they won't stop. Like it's not like when they can be consistent with everybody. Like they they won't lack anywhere. Like buckle you in. So you say Tanzanian men cheat a lot? What? Okay. Well, between men and women in Tanzania, who cheat a lot? What do you think? on your point of view to be honest like because 
most of my friends are girls. Okay, that, that might not be true. But because I hear most of these stories from girls, I hear more about the men, men. if that makes sense. The and men don't really confide in me. Oh, with yeah. Their, well, yeah. Okay, it's me, also embarrassing. Let me confide in you then. <laughs> let me tell you this. Women, mm -hmm. they cheat as much as men do. I'm not, I'm not going to say which one cheats more. But men, we, we're, slip, we're, we're, uh, we're clumsy. We get caught. Women? We're they sly, bruh. They, they don't get <laughs> caught. Ever. They don't. When you... There are, there, there are rare cases where you actually c catch a girl cheating. Like yes. red handed. Yes. Man. <laughs> it's not possible, man. Because, like, I feel like men also, like, why are you... Uh, oh, oh, <laughs> you trying to, oh, you saying that we should up our game type shit, you know what I mean? No, 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 no. Hey, no, hey, we don't got you. Game, we got the, you. Don't, don't sweat it. The game. Don't sweat it. <laughs> don't up the game, please. Don't sweat it. No, you need to cut. <laughs> We no. can't, don't teach them how to do that, man. We're already having a hard time hacking this system. Because <laughs> it's a system. Oh, yeah. We've hacked it. Now uh, you guys want to do, uh-uh. But yeah, no. girls, you should, you girls get, you should put us on, man. No. Like, how do you get, girls do that? What do you mean put you on? Nani kwa tunafanya ya mambo kwanza? Mbona tusingizia? Hmm? Okay. I'm going to drop it. Yes. I'm going to drop Immediately. it. Immediately. <laughs> Uh, how how do I okay? This is like you trying to teach me like mm -hmm. okay. Uh, this is a scenario type of question. You know what I mean, how do I approach a girl who is with a group of friends? Like, tell me right now. If I I'm interested in a girl, and if you're my wingman, right, wing wing woman, that to, to to be exact, how would you tell me to approach the girl with a group of friends? I'm intrigued a bit. Okay, so first you go. Say hello to everyone. Everyone? Generally. Okay. Hey guys, how are you? I just said, hey guys. <laughs> no, 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 like that. Yo, what's up, guys? I don't know how guys are. Yo, what's up? No, 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 whatever. You guys are looking good, but I have my eye on. You say that? <laughs> you actually say that? Wait. Like, what's... Are you saying that? No, no, no. If you, you'd want me to say that. Yes. I'd be like, hey guys, what's up? Uh, Y'all look nice okay. today. But I have my eye on. I got my eye on to uh, Keisha, let's say. I got my own Keisha right here. I don't even know her name. How? Okay, okay. How? No. Yeah, that's true. That's true. All right, let's do it again. Okay. Um, yo, what's up, guys? You guys looking beautiful. What's your name? My name is. My name. Would, would my they name. say that? Like, you know how girls, when, when girls are with a group of friends, oh, they're ratchet. <laughs> really? Yeah. Damn. So, damn. They're <laughs> ratchet. My, me and my friends are nice. Like, it doesn't even matter if we don't think the guy is attractive or we don't like, but acknowledging, I feel like when you're swaili, kwakweli, like, Ooh. not acknowledging a person saying hello to you. Kwanza kusalimiwa sunna. I don't know if that, if you know what that means. Sunna? Sunna in, in Arabic, I might need to be corrected, but it means like a blessing. Okay, okay. Or okay. like, okay, okay, yeah, yeah. We'll, okay. Find a, we'll find a better We'll find a better But yeah, sunna. Kwayo, kuto. Kupokea salam was a bit like, like oh, that's unushamba. Really, uh, unushamba. Yeah, it's definitely unushamba. So if if you approach a group of girls, yeah. now kujibu salam kwa kwa sababu that's not the type of people you're going after. Okay, anyway. okay. Uh, so how do I like like s separate her from her friends and like have a chat with her? Why am I giving you free game? Uh, uh. <laughs> Why am I giving you a free game? No, 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 you're Why are you on. trying to steal this game from me? I ain't giving it to you for free. You don't want me to get it. Okay, fine. Okay, fine. <laughs> <Man>. <laughs> um, Give me Sunna. <laughs> <laughs> right. um, I think that's why I'm saying, like, Uliza, okay. come on, Mishino Kukujibu, Gina, so a half. Uh. Okay, okay, let's see. Okay, so they're like, hey guys, um, you guys look lovely today. Uh, so what, what are your but names? I have my, but I got my eye on her. What's your name? Oh, they'll be like, oh, they'll be like, oh, get yeah, exactly. you got your man. Oh. Like, okay. Do it. No, uh, they're okay, right, yeah, um, Hey, hey, girls. Um, hey, ladies. Uh, you, you look lovely tonight. Uh, Baba, I got my eye on her. What's your name? That's all right. Don't, don't. Like, don't leave. You have to, you have to be direct and you have to be confident when you. Oh, oh, I shouldn't like no stutter. Stu no stuttering. Okay, okay, okay. Oh. Straight up. Oh, straight up, straight up. Yo, what's up, guys? Yeah, uh, yeah, hey, what's up, guys? You, you all look lovely tonight, but I got my eye on her. What's your name? 
Hey, penny drops. <laughs> Jump, Sana. You see, I'm teaching some game. Woo, appreciate it, appreciate it. You, you saw the one. Okay, I feel like that would work. Yeah, it definitely work. I should what try it out. Yeah. I, I should try it out. Yes. I'm going out this weekend, so I'm going to try it out. All right. Um, how do you know your shorty is not yours anymore? Like, he's not feeling you anymore? If I'm a guy like you know, if you, how do you know? Like, you're not feeling me anymore. Uh, this is for this is for the guys. I'm looking out for my boys. Okay, look out for your boys. Yeah. Same boys that are. What do you mean, same boys that are? I don't want to speak too much on it. Uh, <laughs> okay, okay. Um. Hmm. I'm thinking. So you don't know. I feel like girls don't do it on purpose. Like, even if I probably did it, I didn't do it on purpose. So it's more like, I'm not sure. I mean, because to be honest, like, sometimes girls are also scared to be too rude. Okay. So they'll pick up your phone still, like, they'll message you back once in a mm. while type thing. Just, I don't know, but that's me. Like, I, I feel bad sometimes, Shane. Like, especially if the person's like nice and they didn't violate at all. Like, they just you had look genuine. Like you've ghosted a lot of guys. You 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 trying to see that here? Okay, I'm gonna drop it. I'm gonna drop it. I'm drop it. But honestly, I feel like the best way to understand if a short is not feeling you is no. Listen, girls are always on her phone. Like, uh, if, unless she's, like, doing a medical degree and she's, like, super, like, in the, you, that uni or super busy with work. But even though, with all that, they still got time to check their phones. You know what I mean? That's true. That's, that's true. So if she doesn't respond to you, like, that, just know, like, Shorty has better yeah, things to worry about than you, boy. <laughs> Shorty got better things to worry than you. So yeah, to be honest, just be calm, though. <laughs> Don't take it too, too much to heart. If she started not answering your text, be like, oh, damn, okay, oh, okay, I should learn my boundaries. No, no, don't, don't give, you know, sometimes, you know, I figured this out. Correct me if I'm wrong, though. Mm-hmm. Sometimes girls, sometimes when you're with uh, the, the friends and the girls I've been with and associated with, you know what I mean? Sometimes they just don't want you for some time, you know? I tell, you know, sometimes they don't want you looking for them, but they want, she wants to look for you. You know what I mean? Does it make sense? No. Uh, you Does see, like, this is, this is the sense. game my friends were trying to teach me in December, the game. This, what's the game? Like, this game. game, there's this thing called the game, apparently. The girls have that? No. It's a general term. People refer Ooh. to it. Ooh. Like, it's just known as the game. So okay. what you just explained to me right yeah. now, I was taught that it's the game. So like, that you whole, play, like, that, why, why are we doing this toss and turn thing? Why can't I, why can't I just... Call you when I feel like it, and it's fine. And you can call me when you feel like it. It's fine. I, this this thing. I like, don't understand. I, really, I've, I've been away from Tanzania. No, I've just been away from, from our dating. This whole game the, thing. The single life for too long. <laughs> I I can't catch up with you guys. I'm old school. Uh? <laughs> like this whole thing. Yeah, yeah. Like, I mean, honestly, I I, really, I just need someone so, direct. Like I'm not gonna be like oh. <laughs> or I uh, don't text her. I'll answer this in an uh, hour. I'll answer this in four minutes. Like, no, why? Like, if I, I see your text, Shorty, I'm responding. I'm right there, right now. Whoever texts me knows if I see that text, even in milliseconds, I respond just like that. Literally. Bro, I don't play, man. I don't, I don't have Literally, that Literally, like, it's, it's so, like, it's so discouraging to even hear, like, that's why this whole dating life right now, like, is, oh, is to leave to the strong, to be honest. Oh, yeah? Leave it to the strong. You're not looking into dating any time soon? Absolutely not. Like, no. Damn. That's tough. It is tough. <laughs> well, same here, though. Same here, though. Um, okay. There's only one person. Who? On this earth, you'd want to that I would consider right now. That man is in Tanzania. I'm not giving you details. Just that though, like I'm not giving you details. 
Only one man. Only that's what they all man. say. Only that's what they all only say. One man that's that what I, they all one, say. But there's only one man I'd consider. Only one. Okay. Only one. No doubt. No doubt. I'm not, not gonna doubt you. Not, not gonna doubt you. All right. Um. Actually, we are on the last and final question of this, the day. How so soon? Why is it so soon? Oh, oh. Why is it so soon? Oh, oh no. you're I'm enjoying. Like, I'm having a good time, man. I, I know. Really I know you got more questions. I do, but it's just, we gotta like save them for, for another podcast. Okay, fine. Okay, okay, I could do one extra though. Okay, fine. All right. Um. um okay. So let's go to the one. This one last. Man, do, okay. Do you think there's still good men out there? No trolling. Don't sweat it. Ugh. Most deaf. Oh yeah. Most deaf. Facts. No Most cap. deaf. No cap. I I know a lot of good men. Oh yeah. And they're my friends actually. I. I love. Uh, you never date a friend. Mm. There. Mm. Are, <laughs> mm. <laughs> I don't think so. No. You wouldn't date a friend. I wouldn't date a friend because I feel like that would ruin our friendship. No, in case I don't want to, if I intend on pursuing someone, I'm in hopes that obviously it will work out in the end. But if I never thought of pursuing you, I don't know. Like I actually don't want to speak on that because I don't know. <laughs> but I don't think. I would date a friend. I don't think so. Um, me? Especially the friends that I have, God forbid. <laughs> uh, would I date a friend? I don't know. I don't like thinking much about it. You know, when I start developing feelings with somebody, you, you don't choose to develop those feelings. It just happens. So if I end up falling for a friend, I'll address it. If it ruins my friendship, okay. But is it worth ruining your friendship? That I don't know until you go for it. Okay, that's true. You're right. Yeah. But like, yeah, I don't know. I don't. Speak it, it's that. it's it's a, it's a really deep thing, and a lot of people go to to, to denial because they feel like, oh, I don't ruin the friendship. Let me tell you something. Yeah. My male friends uh-huh. are the reason why I fear men. I tell them all the time, like, you guys are the reason why I fear men. Like, that's why I'm so careful, because of you. Like, you guys show me why I should be this careful. Like, so... You're one of the boys, huh? <laughs> I'm definitely one of the boys, and they're showing me, like... I'm thinking, guys, come on. Like, <laughs> you guys don't have hearts or anything, so... Mm. Damn. If it's about the guys, my friends are showing me wonders. <laughs> <laughs> for real, though, it's crazy out there. Uh, we're going to do the one extra question, just for you. Just for me. Yeah. Just for me. Uh, do you think money solves everything? No trolling. Don't sweat it. Absolutely not. Because Ooh. If I'm, I'm speaking from a life point of view on a new user. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Pro- proceed, ma'am. From a life point of view, definitely not. Because I've seen rich people rot in the hospital where doctors cannot do anything. You got what I'm saying? So definitely money can't solve everything. But it definitely, it definitely does the job. Okay, okay. It definitely um, does uh, a job. Yeah, okay. I, I, I 100% agree. Money doesn't solve anything. Everything. Anything. Oh. <laughs> it doesn't solve everything. But let's say, let's, uh, well, when we put it on a scale from 1 to 10, how many, well, how many, uh, how many would you give to, to money? Like, Solving everything. Mm. Seven and a half. Bro, I'm giving it a nine. Don't give it a nine. I'm Yo. telling you, I've seen so many rich people. I'm s- you see that one percent? That's the one percent you're dying in, in in the hospital when you have all that money. I'm telling you, money, the the things you can do with just money gives you. You know, listen. Money gives you access to power. Yeah. Facts. And I feel like people, on my point of view, I feel like a lot of people, when, when they're looking for money, they, they're looking for the privilege the, that comes with having the money. You know how when you're, you're starting off as a, as a let's, say as a, uh, let's say like a content creator, you spend a lot of money making content, you know what I mean? Then when you start getting them deals, you, you don't spend nothing, you just get things for free. You yeah, know what I mean? We're all looking at it, we're looking at it at different points of views. I don't, I, the thing is, because I've seen people with rack struggle, 
and their money is not helping them with anything, I have had the reality check. Okay, that money okay, doesn't okay. solve everything, but it definitely... So seven? Okay, 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 seven is a bit low. Let me okay, not lie. Okay, Let's do 8.5. 8.5 out of 10. Why are you holding back the 0 0.5 that I gave? You said 9. No. 8.5? Yes. 8.8. 8.8. 8. 8. 8. 8. 8. I even went one up for you. Why aren't you appreciative? <laughs> oh, okay. Cool, 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 cool. Like, but uh, this, is, this is not facts, though, but we just, this is uh, basically an assumption. But yeah, guys, that was it for today. Uh, no trolling episode with Soraya, man. Thank you for... Coming in, man. I really Thank you for it. having me. I had a really good time. Oh, yeah? I don't appreciate it. Well, I'm, I'm like out here like, oh, she had a good no time. No sweating. Yeah, don't sweat it. Don't sweat it. <laughs> but yeah, man, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Support your boy, man. You know, this is what I'm doing. And yeah, uh, I'll put her socials down in the description down below. Make sure you hit her socials up, man. And no, no, not the boys. Not the boys? What not, do you mean? Not the not, yes, definitely not the boys. Definitely not the boys, but also tell the guys to chill. <laughs> you, you heard the guys chill. I'm just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, man, until next time in the No Trolling Podcast, yeah, peace out. Peace out.